interested to see which build is going to go. If he's going to go for that heart build that we saw before, or the Eternal Shroud kind of thing. But either way, it just it versus a double melee. He's got ways to play around this bottom lane. It's just it looks really good for Seek. I mean, Tellery just always at the risk of dying if he steps up at all. Yes, he's dead. He is he's very dead. very dead. Blood, I mean, it, it does feel like it. that the game's going to be mana, and the lane positioning is just. In a, in a spot where he's going to get nothing. So they're going to have to sack the lane. He's going to have to just move. Puppy's moving bottom. His job is done. Great setup here from Steve. See Zai been getting pretty aggressive on Sustelary. He actually went for it. He yeah, might he, die for it. He's going to get held in the blood right. The, the boulder from Aramis didn't connect. And Zai. Whoa, fairy, fairy fire. fire. It's going to keep him alive. I mean, rough start. <laughs> you know, if we see sort of Toby able to pick up his game, this game is it's going to be quite quite the comeback of, you know, what has been yeah, this first four minutes of just nothingness for the Enigma as Secret have completely shut it down. TP's going to come in from Aramis, but Toby's dead. He's back to base for 10 seconds. Yeah, they're setting up right now for some runes. Nisha will be able to get that arcane. And, and they might actually go for... I've seen that a couple times where they do set up for the kill onto boom, but I don't know if they have the heroes, the actual damage to be able to the DK at this point. The Vikings definitely going to have to keep a lookout though for Anisha maybe making moves on other lanes. Top lane. Diving in again onto Toby. There'll be a TP over front of Stellar. He could slow here from Aramis onto the two of them. Buys time for Stellar to come in with the stun. They're on to the Timber Man. Have they got enough damage to take him down? They do. They Matthew do. will fall. And that's, look, that's the only damage that they could have on the side of Secret to kill a DK. So a great read of the map by them. Split up right away. Boom gets... It's right back to his place. There is still the three heroes and here. They're they might still looking. They're going to see if they, they've got the control. And they've found that perfect position around the steps. I say that the boom was oh. nice sidestepping. Mass TP's coming in. Boom. He's low, but he's not going to quite fall. The Astral right. Step comes in along oh. with the Simulate. Finally, they get him. But Nisha has had to put himself in a, a very deadly you position to get that kill as Nisha will go down in return. DK. So, yeah. Still does go down. If he lives there, that would be huge. Now he does have his DK form up. He's making the way toward bottom. But, I mean, Secret's responding. They're going to have Rolling Thunder in 15. <laughs> Boom. Top Dragonfall pops, he looks for Puppy, but quick face shift. Dodges the Dragon Tail. Anisha and Zai come into the back blast. They take out Celery. Zai's ult is going to be up in five seconds. They're, they're going to look to fight this again here in a second like secret. They're starting to slow down. Boom. That's it. Beginning the, the preparations for the dive. Zai, he's in. He's got that angle. A couple of bounces in onto Boom. Also onto Aramis coming in. Boom. He's getting low, but Zai hits him once more with the Thunder. As some smooth moves from Zai, set up for an easy fight for Seeker to run them down one by one. Toby's going to nice drop the hole. black hole onto the two of them. There's no damage follow-up, though. Puppy and Matsu still alive. Shad's going to try and come in for the cleanup. A lot of quill spray stacks on Toby's. He's got it back up. Shad just ends up exploding on the front to both Matu and Nisha's damage output. As Stellar and Toby, they've got to run. They're Dyer's trying to get out of there. Matsu starts to lay down the goo. Puppy's got the Dyer's coil. Locks down the two of them as Nisha just and dives just in, in and finishes <laughs> up the cleanup. Roll of Thunder is just, it, the frequency of it is too fast. They can set up for these quick plays a little bit better than Viking is. is. And Chad is very far under the tower right now. Zai, over he goes. Lift up from Yapsil. Zai. Heads over towards Aramis. It means that Aramis is going to struggle to provide any backup. Shad's trying to run for all oh, Yapsor. <laughs> the stolen rupture. I mean, you can see, I think Shad was as, uh, incredibly surprised as he's suddenly like, hang on, I'm bleeding as well. He's dead. Mid lane. Puppy's got the setup with the coil. A quick move oh from secret God. from bottom to mid lane. Yeah. Leave themselves open to, to being jumped in the manner that Viking need to, to to be able to give their squad a chance in this game. Yeah, Aramis is in a good position here. He actually gets a decent connect onto Zai. Immediately lifted and tossed away, though. And won't be able to connect with another slow. Again in position. Aramis is coming in. A really in. nice spot, too. But oh, Toby. Uh, he's looking pretty dead. Zai clips him with the swashbuckle, sweeps around with the thunder. There's no escape. As it's another kill for Yapsor, diving in for more. Rupture down onto Celery. They're trying to run Viking, but Puppy even able to lock him down with the Dream Coil. Nisha's in, easily dodging the blood right with the Dissimilate. Step over onto Shad. Shad to go down. Boom's getting played around with the side. It's getting messy. Four, 15 to Dying 3, 14 minutes in, 8k lead. Knows exactly how Viking wants to play, and they're in their head. That should help!
I don't know what they do. What what, what are that what are, what are you doing in this position? Dyer's I think you've got to be either, it's, it's probably that stage where you you pick up a smoke, you go all in around the DK and see if you can get so, you know Dyer's some sort of kill. Scanning. This Matu is unkillable. Matu can just run Dyer's up any top. high ground with no fear. Well, Pop Puppy just goes in. He just leads straight in. He is not scared at all. Coral down onto Celery. Chad just getting jumped by Nisha and Zark died. Chad's dead. So Celery, it's falling apart completely for Viking. He even gets the lift. He's got the hex follow up. And now they're going to be able to get an eye. He might even just roll on him too. There you go. This was a full early game draft too. That's the thing. It's like it's a DK and a Bloodseeker. So if you're losing this hard in the early, there's just there's no hope to come back. And your Enigma is completely countered, as we've mentioned, at nauseum in this. There's, there's no hope. There's no real hope. They're smoked around trying to look for something, maybe, but see if they can get Nisha. See if they can. They're dropping the finger, oh, everything into the side, but he's got a haste nice. brain. He's able to just step out to the side and he's ready to sweep back in onto Boom. Boom's dead. Ties in with the chase. Stolen no finger, why not? It's. I think that 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 letter G on the keyboard's probably looking very appealing right now for for Viking to to sort of end the pain. Yapsor has a charge of finger and Celery does not. Oh my goodness! Insult to injury. Oh no! Oh no! Dyer's middle just... tower is under attack. Whew. I, I'm I'm speechless at how. I mean, I don't know if it's just it's if it's only just secret being Dyer's that tower is under amazing attack. and just knowing exactly how Vikings gonna play, or if Vikings just Radiant's didn't didn't be clever enough because they just they're, it's everything is just read like a book for secret. Puppy and the boys just just moving from lane to lane, moving from kill to kill, moving from fight. Phenomenal. Love me some clean Dota, Aramis. Let's see if you can get the steal. Let's go for the steal. Like, the That's what he's playing for. Over. Let's the see if he can do it. Be, the fight's going to be pretty much impossible for he's, them, but can they he, steal? He's going to have to go soon. He's done. Oh, he's in it. Oh, he's, oh, it was close. He tried. It was close. Actually getting in the pit before the Aegis was picked up. I wasn't able to grab it himself. Boom's committed in with the other dragon. They get the black hole down onto the two. They have managed to catch both the claws. They will okay. get the kill on Tanisha with this. But of course, no way of killing off Matuma Man. They stole the black hole from Yamsor. <laughs> sure, why not? I mean, why not? Why not do so to close it up? Dyer's top tower has fallen. <laughs> Tough one. Still, still some smiles there with Aramis. Trying to, looks like he's trying to keep the spirits up here for Viking. They they know that this is uh, a quite quite the position they're in, attack. but you know, well why not why not go out with at least uh, a few more bangs, a few more attempts here at a fight. You know you, you know the sort of the, the cards are against you here against Secret, and here we go, smoke up, smiles all around. Yes, get puppy, just get puppy. Uh, that's, that's what that's they want to do. Be, that's gotta Buy be the goal. Puppy. Get puppy. Kill, kill the puck. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. That's their goal. Who, who if I, if I can get a kill here, this is going to be a win for them. They know, that's all they GP. want. They just want one Dyer's kill here. Dyer's middle tower has fallen. Are they going to be giving it though, Salary? They're all sticking together. They've got the one ward right there on the high ground. Dyer's Swooping. middle tower is under attack. Who's it going to be? Precious bounty. <laughs> not, not looking to be on track to find anyone. Dyer's bottom tower just wait, is find under one. attack. Oh, they want just one. A prize. Someone will TP for the roof. They're hoping. Oh, take that. Oh, a stack. Okay, they found hey. a nice juice. All stack. right, <laughs> hey, there <laughs> that this Mars, Look at that. They love that. <laughs> Chad's like, all oh, right, that's that's a win right there. That is a win right there. Get that. Get the get those stacks. And the ancients as well. Look at that. And their birthdays and Christmas is coming at once. Yeah. <laughs> oh, poor them. I love it though. I love when you just you know it with the I love it. I love this spot. And it's sort of the, the, the contrast. Well, meanwhile, on speaker, puppy's like, we must win this game. Yep, so. Let the world not by whatever they got, puppy. They all tip him and they cheat. I mean, there we go. There we go. They, I, like I mean, they know it. They knew it. It, it was a tough one for Viking. They, they go out with some smiles. Secret. Of course, they got business as usual here for Secret. As, uh, some, uh, smiles. some smiles. Some smiles. Some smiles there. Nisha, I mean, he's got people. The rest of them in full focus mode. Puppy actually...